Hi, Jerry Matthews from Starting Line Products here with you today to explain our clutch kit for a 2017-2018 Polaris Razor Turbo. Now this cl clutch kit will come to you in a box much like this. And the contents of the box, you'll find a drive clutch spring, a spring spacer, power pucks, magnum force weights, and tuning instructions and installation instructions to help you install your kit properly and have it set up properly for your elevation and riding style. Okay, now let's talk about the drive clutch spring and spring spacer. So what we've used here is a fairly large wire diameter spring to give us lots of rate so we can have fairly low engagement, yet we can have the rate needed to have the proper uh, RPM on top and shift characteristics that we're desiring. Now, it works in conjunction with this spring spacer. The spring spacer is an aluminum part and as you can see, it's got a thin area in the center that steps out to a thicker area on the outside. And why that is is so that the spring fits down inside of there. It gives us a little extra room for the larger diameter spring so the spring doesn't come to coil bind prematurely. Yet, we still maintain the thickness on the outside is to maintain the shift limiting characteristic of the stock spacer so that the drive clutch does not overdrive the driven clutch causing belts to blow at top speed. Magnum force weights are another key feature of our clutch kits. These are specifically for the Razor Turbo. These are uh, different than any other weight on the market in the fact that they're a heavy heel design, have a center tapped and threaded center area to where you can add or subtract weight via set screws. Then we use a lock set to hold them in. We use a poly bushing that's shouldered to eliminate friction. Uh, these weights provide extremely smooth engagement and uh, uh, great top end pull. Now let's talk about the power pucks. So what the power pucks are is they are a poly puck essentially, a slider that go into the uh, drive clutch, they eliminate the stock sliders that are on the spider. The stock clutch slider is a beveled design. It's kind of a triangular shaped design. It sits in the clutch in this position, right here. And when centrifugal force acts on it, it pushes the slider out. Well, the design is such that um, each of the sliders are meant to slide at the same relationship to one another to hold everything centered in there. Well, the negative thing that happens is um, you get dirt in into these clutches and then these sliders stick. So it gives you a kind of a, a ratchet type of a, of a feel when you first try to take off. That's, that's a huge annoyance for one of these cars, especially when you're trying to drive them at slow speed, like say rock crawling or, you know, pulling it onto a trailer or um, maybe you're just trying to pull it out of your driveway and it's going um, not, not a very pleasant thing to have happen. So what the uh, power puck does is it's a slider that replaces these. So you'll replace this stock slider and the stainless steel piece behind it. And what that does is it puts everything in parallel with each other. I've got another clutch right here that I'll exchange right now and show you how it works. So this has got the power pucks installed and you can see there's no slider on the, uh, on the three towers. Well, there's a little clearance built into it and it's designed to be self-cleaning of the dirt and grime and whatnot to where that doesn't affect it. And it slides on the tower and keeps everything parallel as it goes through its shift. Um, customers, when they first ride in a car that's uh, uh, equipped with power pucks, when they've been used to the stock clutching, they, the first thing they say is, I can't believe how smooth that is because it really is. It engages nice and smooth, takes off nice and smooth. You can, you can start at a very low uh, speed range and just crawl around if you'd like to 
without any of that ratchety feel that's a huge annoyance. So the power packs do take um, a little time to install because you have to glue them in place, uh, but it's nothing that uh, um, is too horribly bad. Just you have some glue time to let them dry before the car can be uh, ridden. Great product. Uh, I don't know of any other company that's even coming close to what we're doing here with these power pucks as far as from a, a standpoint of performance. Uh, the friction alone that we're reducing, it gives us an extra 200 RPM with no other changes. So that's huge. Um, so in addition to the, the low speed response and getting rid of that ratchety feel, top end performance is uh, improved as well. So great piece. Uh, we're uh, extremely happy with it. Um, you know, the guys that are running them on the sands, they're even able to run without a clutch cover on uh, to keep their clutches cool without uh, uh, sticking their uh, um, stock sliders all the time. And uh, uh, belt life's improved, clutch life's improved. Um, you know, if you really want to make your, your clutches uh, last well, this is one of those pieces you'll you'll need, it's a must have.